what's up you guys, my name is Average Dolph, and welcome back to KH2 Final Mix. So in the last episode, we almost completed all the rocks this days, this days because that was a live stream, which, uh, by the way, sorry that cut off at a weird moment, I don't know what happened, but apparently my Elgato decided to stop recording just under two hours, hours, which was super weird, and a similar thing happened last night, like I was trying to record an episode of this again last night, as nice to see if I can get like a third video in which actually no a fourth video because four videos a day that's a lot for me but uh, I guess I was just decided like hey screw you I'm just gonna dig over it but uh, so far everything's fine which uh, by the way if I keep looking at my computer it's it's not like I am Ow! Oh, come on I tried to hit that but anyways if I'm looking at my computer Look at that over here, like, to the lower part of my monitor. It's not that I'm not paying attention to you guys. It's, uh, like, I need to make sure that it, that, that the system is still receiving a signal and it's n not being an idiot and deciding to, you know, just like, you know what, screw you, I'm just going to stop. Out. Out. Stop it. Oh, come on! I hate potion! Fucker. Okay, now that those guys are done, well, we gotta get this fucker here. Okay, why am I not hitting him? There we go. Okay, alright, get a chance before he attacks. It's kind of spooky. Oh, there were some desks over here. I didn't see them last time. But yeah, last night it was super weird. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 no. Oh, come on. Alright, fine, I'll ignore you. Oh, shit. Oh, man, I hope I'm not gonna die. I tried blocking it. No, no. I'm not gonna die by a stupid dusk. Okay, uh, go forth. Go forth. So yesterday was very productive for me. I got three videos in. Anyways, ow, damn it! I should have seen that coming. But yesterday was very productive for me, so I managed to get three videos in. Which is way more than I usually do, because sometimes I like, try to at least do one. And that's sort of like my plot and plan for like when summer hits. I want to do want to get in like at least one video a day. I might score for two. Possibility of three. Like depending on if I have other plans ends that day, I might do like I might just go ahead and do as many videos as I can. That's not a guarantee, but uh, depending on what sort of kind of plans And I or my family might, I or my family might be doing, be doing. It could be like a whole bunch of videos, bunch of videos happening, which is very. There we go. Finally, you managed to block it. But anyways, that's very productive for me. Ow! My. Okay. And today, I think I might score for that many again. That's not a guarantee, but after this, I want to try to do, like, another LEGO Arts episode. It's been a while since I've done one of those. Uh, and I currently have a showcase set up. I just need to record. Yeah, so that's... So that should be on the list for today. It's kind of spooky on how, like, this whole place is like a ghost town. You know what? Let's just get these guys. And just go on in. Because we really need to go. And I'll just go ahead and skip this one. Uh, for the sake of my capture card, I might just go ahead and skip, like, some cutscenes that I may see as, like, not really important. Mm -hmm. Not in the sense that I don't want to record every single detail that I have, have here, but I want to get, I want to at least get, like, in the stopping point that I want to do. Like, want to go out into the world map. I want to make sure that I at least get out there. 
out there. And just to make sure that, like, uh... Ow! Oh my! Oh my! Why are my systems not working today? It's like the game doesn't want to be want me to progress, which is super weird because I really enjoy this game. Okay, there we go. There we go. Ow! I keep forgetting they're like suicide bombers. Okay, here we go. Oh, what about those? Okay, nice, 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 nice. But yeah, with like uh, skipping a few cutscenes, it's not that I don't want to do those cutscenes. It's that like I want to get into a good stopping point. So like, uh, like I don't feel like I wasted a day of recording. And this morning, I got up early in the morning because like I want to continue. Like I could have just continued on with Sword's part and just be done with it. But I didn't want to roll like that. I wanted to. To Al. Yeah, yeah. I wanted to, like, do. Uh, ow. Feel like I can finish up all the Roxas episodes. Episodes. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Okay, let's just go ahead and talk to Nominee. But yeah, like, I could have just gone ahead with the solar episode and be done with this, but I didn't want to do that. I wanted to. We're going to continue off with the Roxas episodes, because my original plan with the live stream was to do, like, all the Roxas episodes in one stream. But because my Elgato decided, like, screw those plans, I'm not going to do any of that. It kind of put a monkey wrench in those plans, especially when it just stopped, and I didn't realize it until I was a little farther in the game. Luckily, I didn't save, and like, later on in the game, and, uh, and just looked over and realized, like... God damn it, I have to do all of that again. And I found out that if I do a speedrun, like uh, in the earlier episodes, Your mind's made up. you get done in like half an hour, which Why is very productive. Why did choose me? I have to know. You can't turn on the organization. Can, and I will. Lemonade. Organization 13. They're a bad group. Bad or good? I don't know. They're a group of incomplete people who wish to be whole. To that end, they're desperately searching for something. What? Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> Funny? It's just... I think... I've been running away from the question I really want to ask. What's gonna happen to me now? Just tell me that. Nothing else really matters anymore. You are... Nominate! Ah, oh, they're gonna steal my friend! Nominate! No, wait, come back, come back, come back, come back! There's no knowledge that has the power to change your fate. No, fuck Even you, dude! Doesn't. Douchebag! I wanna know. I have the right to know. A nobody doesn't have a right to know. What does that make you, then? Does it even have the right to be. Because in all honesty, what is a nobody. I'm having trouble deciding like which one's really a nobody. Diz, Roxas Too many or Diz. Because I feel like he's more heartless and nobody Roxas, than the actual ones. Nobodies like us are only half a person. You won't disappear. You'll be whole. I'll disappear? Dude, you just said you'll be whole. No further outbursts. No, you won't hey, disappear. Hey, you look out, my friend! Oh no! <sighs> Roxas, we will meet again, and then we can talk about everything. I may not know it's you, and you may not know it's me, but we will meet again someday soon. I promise. Let her go. Nominate. FUCKER! GIVE ME BACK MY FRIEND! Now many sketches. Okay, now that we have the sketches, that's it. Oh, shoot. Right. Heal. 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 Okay, save. Okay, save, and save here. Like, see what I mean? I mean, like, when this goes away. See, I have an extra file here, just in case I have to redo this again, which I am hoping not! Because, 
I want to get more done at this point in time. But man, they took my friend. They took Nomine. That is not cool. So a little fan notes that I'm hoping happens in KH3 is that like Roxas and Nomine will like end up as a couple. Up full. Because uh, I, I think the relationship is cute. And I really hope they end up together. What, gang? Oh, oh, well, you're just a bunch of haters then, aren't you? Especially you in the back. I heard that. Wait, who is that? Who? Fucking Justin. Get out of here, Justin. Fucking asshole. I hate that dude. <laughs> Out of my way! Uh, I'm gonna miss him! Yeah. Ow, ow, ow. Yeah. How weird. <laughs> Get out of here! Mm. Here, oh, there's a little chest. Okay, I got the chest. High potion. Okay. That'll really come in handy. Because I really need those. It does, especially since after this there's a boss fight. And I think I got all the chests. Yeah, I got all the chests. Wait. Look at this little corner. Okay, nothing's there. Okay. Just want to make sure. Because I know that's when I'm done with the Roxas episodes, I can only go back to one section of the digital Twilight Town, and that's when. It's when I have to. Go through the portal. Uh, through the portal to darkness. Okay. Uh, this is all out of the way. I probably we get to come back to like this section in KH3 because I know in some of the worlds, especially repeats, they give they only give us like a certain area that we can travel to, and then the rest is blocked off. So I really hope we get to come back down here. All right. Okay, there we go. Nice, nice. I have half a mind to just let these things explode. Ow, will you stop it? Okay, I can at least get this one. Okay, now... Okay, your combat has fallen. Now it's your turn. Yes! Okay, now next up is the boss fight. Simply amazing, Roxas. Axel. Axel. You really do remember me this time. Of course. I'm so flattered! But you're too late! Not so fast! And so oh yes! Oh yes! Dual Keyblade action! Damn right! This is my favorite part! Cause I get two Keyblades! So I saw that, uh, I saw- I once saw a video that someone took this boss fight and took out, like, out- They, like, took out uh, the original music and replaced it with a- uh, with a rock, uh, pfft, with a rock battle remix of Shion's battle theme, which I think was super cool. Cause it really fit well, cause it really fits well to like what is going on here. Woo! That's boomerang action. Wish I could play as dual rocks as like for now on in this game. Cause that was my favorite, and I really hope that. He's a playable character in KH3, and he also gets the two key, the two keyblades. That'd be, that would be very awesome. 
You get on their bad side and they'll destroy you! No one would miss me. I would! That's not true! I would. Axel. Let's meet again in the next life. Yeah, I'll be waiting. Silly. Just because you have a next life. <sighs> we know here's the realm. There's a portal to the realm of darkness, but we can't go. We can't go through there until. So this is how it ends. Once I go through that door, the Roxas days are done. So this is how it ends. After all of his hard work, after all of his amazing skills! <sighs> I don't want to go, but... Alright. I've... lived for too long. I hate you so much. You and me both. You should share some of that hatred with Sora. He's far too nice for his own good. Would it fucking kill you to at least hear a slight bit? You fucker! Now get out of my monitor! Sora. <sighs> the music. The moment. I actually found this and the mega version much sadder. Looks like my summer vacation is over. I found Roxas's death in the books a lot sadder than in the games because in the books, Roxas gets like his life flashes before him, and then we actually see him die. We see him fade away, and I didn't cry, but I felt so sad. Just reading that, and just seeing, like, Roxas is so sad, like, all he really wanted in life, like, he didn't want power, he didn't want money, all he wanted was to spend the rest of his life with his friends. And just knowing that he won't be able to do that again for a long time. Sora! Who's there? I'm afraid the sadness will have to wait for another day. Sora, wake up! Get to a rooster call, but it's like. <laughs> Time to wake up! Good rest. Okay, uh, still getting a signal? Yep. Okay. We're all good. Donald, good morning. Goofy. <laughs> Is it a little bit rude the fact that they gave us something sad and then immediately give us something happy? Yeah, that was some nap. Like, it's moments like that where we need to grieve. We were asleep? I guess we must have been, or I don't think we'd be so drowsy. When do you think we went to sleep? Let's see. We defeated Ansem. Yep. Restored peace to the world. You mean the universe? Found Kyrie. Oh yeah. And then we went to look for Riku. I think that's right so far. You forgot that's getting right. stuck in a memory castle. Hmm. Like I know they don't remember it, but that still counts. To say, Jiminy. Gee, there's only one sentence. Thank Namine. Hmm. I wonder who that is. Right. We no longer remember Nominee. <laughs> Which I'm kind of wondering in in the game recoded. I'm kind of wondering if uh, if like in recoded we've regained everything. Like we now remember everything that happened to us. That's kind of one of those interesting things. 
No, excuse me. I'm kind of wondering if that happens now. Also, Roxas has been passed. We got the journal. Okay, I know we have a couple of treasure chests here, so let's go get them. So now our real journey begins. And it is a little bit interesting on how the music changes between Roxas and Sora. Like, it's this song for Sora, and then it's a different song for Roxas. It's kind of interesting to see how that... And how they both changed. I wonder why they didn't just kept the same. You know, I think I've been to this town. That is a little interesting thing that now that I think about it, mm. I wonder if that's that's give us hints that that's Roxas's memories, it. or maybe some remains of Sora in Castle Oblivion. Because I know I haven't, because I haven't gotten that far yet, but I do know that at one point uh, I'm gonna wind up in Twilight Town, which is kind of interesting because Sora has never been to Twilight Town. Oh, now that I'm thinking about it, I wonder if that's in a way shows the connection between him, Shion, and Roxas. What do you want? Uh, nothing. Just wondering what was back here. Yes, just passing through, Sal. So. Now you know. This is our spot. My apologies. Um... What? You're new around here, right? You could say that. I'm Pence. Hayner, nice to meet you. But we got stuff to do, so catch you later. Bye, man. My name's Olette. Hey, did you finish up the summer homework yet? Independent studies are the worst, huh? Homework? In the summer? That's an abomination right there. Hey, what are your names? Oh, sorry. Uh, we're Sora, Donald, and Goofy. Hey there. And my name is Cyber Snow Wolf, but you can call me Cyber for short. Sora, Donald, Goofy, we just met someone who was looking for you. He sure seemed in a hurry. He had a black coat on, so I couldn't see his face. But he had these big round ears. Gee, I wonder who that could be. It's kind of ridiculous how it takes them a little bit to figure it out, because... I'm sorry, but big round ears? That is a dead giveaway. better get back to that assignment. Because I don't think there's... Because I'm pretty sure there is not a person on the planet who doesn't know what Mickey Mouse looks like. Oh boy, the kids tried to find us. Yeah, let's get to the station. Whoop, whoop. That is so... Uh, which means if we get to the station, everything will all be good. Can I get an A, man? Can I get a higher than you? It's Sammy! Sammy! Can you give me an A, man? No? Okay. <laughs> Probably not a good idea because he is weird. Crazy weird. Okay, where's my skateboard? Skateboard! Can I go down here? Nope. Oh man. Oh wait, I know there's Cypher here. Uh, should I go to him? Yeah, I'll just go ahead and skip the cutscene because uh, I gotta save time. Make sure system is working fine. I don't want any more interruptions. So, screw you, douche. I'll go back to you. Okay, nobody's are trying to block our way to get to the train. I gotta destroy these things first, and then I'll be on my way to the train. <laughs> Even though these guys die a lot, it is good to have like party members to help uh, destroy these things, especially given of like how many show up. They show up. Okay, Goofy's amount is increasing. Ooh. I think that's just. That's the MP, which I have not unlocked yet, which is unfortunate. Unfortunate because moments like these, magic could really come in handy. Yeah. Man, these things are hell-bent on getting Roxas back. It's a little bit too late for that one, Sonny! At least not for a while. For a while, because he's going to return in KH3. Okay, got him, Namine, Shion, uh, those three are coming back, as well as Terra Aqua events, ow, ow, could you please stop hitting me, I'm in the middle of talk to ow, how rude, okay, well at least we did a cutscene, oh, and the other two just collapse, because it was kind of realistic that, like, I can't battle on forever,
Now you decide to show up. Show off. Your Majesty? Shh. You gotta board the train and leave town. The train knows the way. Here. Your Majesty! What? No hello or goodbye? The king? How rude! Is that really him? It could have been. No, it was Oswald the It was Oswald the Lucky Rabbit or Ben the Ink Demon. What do you think it was? Oh my god. The king was locked in the realm of darkness, right? Oh, it actually shows his pants but and his shoes. We just saw him. I originally thought that it was and just a silhouette. Is here, that means Riku's here. Because that's kind of the thing with me, like... Well, when playing this on a TV, for Riku. it's much more of a distance away. Go back to the and when it's on my monitor, I can easily I see a lot this. more. It's kind of funny, if you think about it. Gorsh, Sora, do you have to ask? what's so funny? Your face. What do you say, guys? Let's stick together for one more journey. To... where again? We have to board the train! Oh, yeah. Hi, hear you, Donald. I was just like... Oh, my God. Money patch! Okay, now we got some money. Uh, crystal orb. And secret report. Nice. Okay, now we're in the central station. Okay, we gotta get... Like, I know there are a couple of chests here. We gotta make sure we go get those. Uh, there's a chest. And there's one. And there are two in the back. We'll go get those. <sighs> so, out of curiosity... Curiosity... Who else is kind of excited? Uh, was excited to see, like, the... K... The newest K H Street trailer. I actually kind of like it, because it shows, like... The minigames are back again, and they're... A little bit different this time. Because this time... Oh, uh, this is just... Alright, uh, because this time it shows us, like, it's very 8-bit style. Well, not really 8-bit, just very old school, which I think is kind of cool. Okay, let's go. Bye. Hey, Sora, you sure we haven't met before? Positive. Why do you ask? I don't know. <laughs> Just one of those things. I do like how, how Hainer, Pence, and Olets get like new wardrobes. Get like a new wardrobe. That's very nice. It's very cool. It shows the update on clothes. Like everyone gets a new outfit. Well, except for Donald and Goofy, because yeah, they wore the same clothes ever since the first game. Put together. And aside from right. the knight armor so, yeah. uh, from their royal clothing, only when they're at Disney Castle, everything else is pretty much the same. Which I don't know if uh, the developer either wants to keep their outfits the same or they just get lazy and decide like, you know what, let's just not touch that. That's just my general thinking. If you have a different idea, feel free to just you know, say out loud. Hmm. And yesterday, like when recording, I was aiming to record, aiming to record like, uh, a video on KH Union X because now that I have the HDMI adapter I can record so far I can record stuff on my iPad but so far I haven't been able to record stuff on my phone which I kind of uh, I'm debating whether or not to just reinstall the app on Union X <laughs> uh, on my pad because like I've done that I've tried that in the past and so far it won't let me get all of my data and plus with the phone I can access wherever I am like, when I'm on the road, and in case I forgot to do something, I can go ahead and do it. I'm sad. Hmm. We'll be back! Yeah! We can visit Hainer and those guys again! Yeah, man. We always come back. But in case you're kinda c you guys are kind of curious, like, who am I on Union X? And in X, I go by my Kingdom Hearts name called Arcturus. So that's kind of a mouthful. Kind of a mouthful, but that's like my K H O C C 
he's my KHOC. Which, like, backstory I might get into if I get around, if I figure out how to do how to record Union X. Union X, because, like, that might not be a full series, but I want to at least show you guys, like, what I've accomplished so far. Ah, here's our stop. The Mysterious Tower. And there goes the train. <laughs> there goes our ride. Okay. It's just... Why? Yeah, the tower. Okay. And there's another chest. It's a little interesting that I find it kind of odd on how, like, two worlds are connected. Like, Twilight Town is connected to two different worlds. We have this one, the Mysterious Tower, and then the world that never was, which we won't get into until later on. Ah, uh, there's Pete. <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> I sent some of my lackeys inside to see if the master of this here tower's as big and tough as they say. Word is he's a real powerful sorcerer, which would make him the perfect bodyguard for me. See, it don't matter how tough he is. Once he's a heartless, he'll do as I say. Uh-huh, well... Isn't it a little right. stupid, the fact the that, that come out of the he is explaining his entire off. plan we to strangers he doesn't side. know My dear friend, and doesn't know whether or not everything. they're good or bad? Hey, How stupid is that? Debt to pay, I'm going hmm. round ah, to excuse a bunch me, sorry. Of different worlds and building an army of Heartless, special for her. Oh, why am I talking to you pipsqueaks anyway? Go on, Scram, I'm behind schedule as it is. You ought to find something nicer to do. Oh, says who? Huh? Oh, it's you! You think he would have recognized them when what he heard their voices? What are you doing here? What are you doing here? You know him? We sure do. Pete's been causing trouble for ages. His Majesty banished him to another dimension a long time ago. I wonder how he escaped. So, <laughs> different game, same cat. You wanna know how, eh? Well, Maleficent busted me out, that's how. And now your world, no, 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 all the worlds are gonna belong to yours truly. Cause uh, Maleficent's gonna help me conquer them. Maleficent, huh? That green bitch? <laughs> <laughs> oh, what are you laughing at? Why, Maleficent's power is so great that- She's toast. Huh? Sorry, but Maleficent can't help you now. What do you mean? You! So you're the ones that did it! Wait, wait! Well, we might have had something to do with it. Mm-hmm. Heartless Squad, round up! Ah, oh, the Heartless are now back again. I played this before, but come on, Pete! Shadows? Shadows? Really? If you're gonna conquer the world, then you might as well summon more than incompetent, mindless monkeys. Monkeys, it's just like, just like they're now rookies getting off a training camp. Like, all right, mom, now get running, now get running, all right, fight like a man, fight like a man. And then when they fail, it's like, no, you're all and I do bloody horrible. Messes with the mighty Pete. So mighty Pete, who lives in this tower anyway? Oh, you don't know, eh? Well, it's old Yen Sid. Of course, he's probably a heartless by now. Master Yen Sid lives here? You should know that, Donald! You have been here before! Oh my god, did that sleep really did a damage on their brains or something? Wow, sounds powerful. Because it's just like, oh my god. No, 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 no. Okay, now we're inside the tower. Find the tower, I'll save it a second. Yep. Single's still going strong, which is good. Wow. 
This has been going on for an hour, which has been very good. An hour and nine minutes. Wow. That's a lot earlier than you than normally. Because most of the time I get down, done with rocks is around like three hours. But then again, when I just skip through most of the stuff and just speed on through, you get stuff done a lot faster. <laughs> Come on, Shadows! Shadows, you're not even putting out much of a fight! Even my cat! Huh. Hey, even my cats can beat your asses! Mm. Man up! Mm. But then again, they are mindless, so... I guess they really can't understand anything, anything that I had just said. Oh, and there's a little... Oh, and there's another little arrow that's going, going up, like a little elevator. Which, by the way... Jensen really should consider of putting an elevator in this, cause no offense to him, but a dude at his age, you might want to consider some other transport. A knight! You got a knight? Okay, maybe you actually can man up. See, you should follow like your friend here. Here, like an actual heartless. Cause I almost feel like, except for Sora. Except for Sora, these things are... Except for, like, Sora... The little shadows are kind of like failed abortions, in a way. Well, failed experiments, I guess. Heartless, heartless, heartless. Kids have kids one bit. Yep. Well, it's a good thing we're on the job, then. Yep, yep. So, the worlds aren't at peace after all? In a way, I don't think they'll ever be at peace. Like, in life, well, life in general, I don't think there's truly peace. Because in some way or form, there's always going to be some kind of conflict, whether that's with yourself or that's with the rest of the world. But in some way or form, there's going to be some kind of conflict that will, that will keep us uh, from truly having, from truly being at peace. Okay, now we're in the tower. Uh, save. Oh, and gotta get this map. Yeah. This map is also important. Whoop! Thank you. But wait a sec. How come the Heartless are still running around? Your past endeavor <coughs> did prevent an immense yeah, fusion of Heartless from the Great Darkness. Make no mistake about that. However, the Heartless are darkness made real, and darkness yet lingers in every heart. The Heartless are fewer, but while darkness exists in a single heart, it will be difficult to eliminate them. Gorge, that must mean if everybody's heart was full of light, them Heartless would go away. That's impossible. I'm sorry, but that's just oh, impossible. It is time to speak of the enemies that you will encounter. There's always a darkness inside us. Like, no matter how hard we try to get rid of it, there's always some form of darkness in us. Like, even... Probably, like, I know the princesses of Har... But they're supposed to be hearts of pure light, but... Yields to the darkness maybe in, in some heart, way or form, there's some kind of darkness in them. Heartless. But their hearts but are too good that... It helps, like, uh, the keep that darkness locked away. And ever seeking to capture new hearts. Never let your guard down. Now then. Ah, uh, the dusk? At times, if someone with a strong heart and will, be they evil or good, becomes a heartless, the empty shell they leave behind begins to act with a will of its own. So I'm kind of confused. Does that mean an empty vessel every heart has been stolen? Every heart is a strong heart. A spirit that goes on. Because there are a ton of nobodies. Body fades from existence. For you see, nobodies do not truly exist at all. Nobodies may seem to have feelings, but this is a ruse. They only pretend to have hearts. Then you do not know a single fucking thing. 
because Roxas, no Shion, way. Namine, even Axel, they, they all had sense. feelings in their own ways because they had hearts in their own ways. Now then, the being you see, and even with you like is known as a the dark. other nobodies that we've seen, they like the rest of the organization, no sure they didn't really show much emotion, there are other but they all had their own designated emotions in some way or form, like. Syax was a dick. A uh, brig. Well, you will meet an alarming number uh, of dust. Uh, Zigbar. Yeah, there we go. We'll Zigbar is an ass. Uh, Lexius is the strong in silence. Vexen is an you egghead. Larkseen's a bitch. Even Demex was a goofball but and a slacker in some in his own way or form. So I guess in a way, they have their own emotions. I guess. But that's just me personally thinking, like, if you want to go ahead with their logic, that's the okay. The beings you see before you now are different. These powerful nobodies have formed a group called Organization 13. It commands the lesser nobodies. I do like it how it shows the three different versions, like... Organization 13. There's, like, there are the few with sleeves that really go up to the arms, really show of how skinny they are. Uh, then the other one has like no wider sleeves. In a the sleeves. He's uh, really. But the cuffs really go out wide. Goal. Excuse me. And that goal is and then that one has the broad have. shoulders. The king sensed the danger and journeyed forth to fight it. He found the Dark Realm's keyblade and with it closed the door. Now he's traveling from world to world, fighting the heartless as he seeks the answer to the riddle of the nobodies and Organization 13. Then I guess we better go find the king first. What world could he be? Well, we won't know till we look. Yeah, and the king must know where Riku is, because the two of them were together in the realm of darkness when we closed the door. You know, after defeating Ansem. I'm not entirely sure about that. Before you go, you will need more suitable traveling clothes. Yes, please. Those look a bit too small for you. Oh Through my god. There, you'll find three good fairies. If you ask, they'll create for you appropriate garments. Gore, Sora, you sure are growing fast. Uh, I guess. Yeah, dude. Cuz. <laughs> Your shorts are now way too short. Way too short. Uh, uh, your jacket probably doesn't cover up that much. That much. Like, seriously. Am, are, your sh are your feet cramping in there? Like, seriously, if I were in clothes like that, my feet would probably... I'd probably be super sore, and I'm like, this is bullshit. Please, give me some more wearable clothes. Sora, Donald, and Goofy. Oh, if you're looking for clothes, you've come to the right place. Alrighty. I'll do the designing. Alright. Make me handsome. No, oh, um, that will never do. Color is not what I meant by new clothes. Okay. But don't you like this better? Okay, don't get me wrong. The clothes look the clothes look fantastic. Hold on. Like the color the colors are nice. I don't want are colors. I don't want I don't just want to change the color. I actually want something that will make me move my body much faster. Uh, sir, and make it for where like I'm not crushing myself. Please. Ah uh, Would you just decide? Yes, please! Oh, oh, oh. Well, oh. <laughs> all right then. Together now, dears, and no more squabbling. There we go. Oh my! Oh yeah! Oh, it's lovely. Mm. Oh yes, he does look very dashing. And for the longest time, this was like the go-to Sora outfit, but now it's the flannel. It's now the K83 outfit with the flannel, which I really love that jacket. I get I think that'd be awesome. Okay. Touch the orb. And watch what happens. Super Moon! Wow! 
Ooh. Whoa. Nice, nice. Wow. Two keyblades. Mm-hmm. This journey's going to be twice as difficult as your last. <sighs> what you expect, dude? The elements also have other powers. But you'll have to discover what they are as you continue on your journey. Right, right. Okay, I'll do my best. And thanks a lot. Whoop, whoop. Oh, and there's something else for you from Master Yen Sid. Oh, boy! Star Seeker. Nice. Got my first, first extra Keyblade. Valoran form. Like, I think I got all the Keyblades. E blades back when I played this game the first time. First time. And I think I've unlocked everything now. Okay. Woo, this feels so much better. It feels nice, too. Okay, let's head on out. Huh? Huh? Sora, I think you dropped something. Hmm? Huh? It must have fallen out of your pocket. I can't do a good Donald voice. What is it? Part of a picture? Is this a gift, too? Oh, we don't know anything about that. But if you found it in your pocket, it must have something to do with your adventure. Hold on to it, dear. In fact, you should hold on onto any other pieces you come across your journey. Okay. Okay, Jimmy. I'll make sure you're to note them in my journal. Puzzle piece. Yes! I remember... I remember I had to look at... Uh, uh, someone did a collaboration of how many puzzle pieces they had to collect. Like, they went to all the worlds, and they even went back through their previous videos. Not through their previous videos to find out, like, how many pieces they need to get. So, yeah, the puzzle pieces, uh... I don't know if that's gonna be an episode of their own, or I'll just collect them as I travel on. But, yeah, those are gonna take for... Those are gonna take a long time to find. And I feel very strong that this might be, like, one of the few Kingdom Hearts games that I'll finish first. Hey, it's the like, depending on when KH3 is releasing, because I am really hoping it gets released soon! <sighs> We're gonna at least give us an actual you guys date. Ready to go? I might get this done before or after. Now, now, just a moment. Uh, what now? Because of your previous endeavors, the worlds have returned to their original states. That means the pathways between them have disappeared. How do we get around? Do not fear. If what the king suspected proves true, the worlds have prepared new pathways along which you may travel. These pathways may be utilized by unlocking special gates. How these gates are opened, I'm afraid I do not know. However, the Keyblade will serve as your guide. When a beam of light radiates from the Keyblade, return to the Gummy Ship. Though the worlds may seem far apart and out of reach, they nonetheless remain connected by invisible ties. As do our hearts. We are all universally our connected. Are connected. Mm -hmm. That is correct. Got it. But be warned. Mm -hmm. As you proceed, the heartless and the nobodies will be using their own paths. Corridors of darkness to travel from world to world. They may be attempting to link these dark pathways to the gates between the worlds. How that not fair? Life is not fair. Now then, that is all the information I can give to you. Go forth, Sora, Donald, and Goofy. Everyone is waiting. Oh, that's just making me okay, let's get going. think of how excited I was when I saw that the trailer for uh, a final trailer for this game came out, and I was like, what? I'm kind of wondering, where is he going? Howdy, Sora. How you doing? Doing good. How about you? It's your favorite gummy engineer. 
players here ready for duty. Chip and Bale. Nice. Happy flying. What? What? Awesome. Only one? That's no good. Wait, I think it's a world we know. Even better. Woo! Yep, there it is. Uh, save. If I finally managed to get to where I am. And that world we're gonna have to explore for another day. For another day. Because I'm gonna leave this episode of KH2 Final Mix here. Mix here. Because A, I wanted to get to this section. And B, I should probably stop just in case a, uh, the capture guard decides to stop again. So, I'm glad I really got this far done. Right done, which is very good. Very good. And... Expect next video to be a LEGO Showcase video, because I really want to get around to it, because I just finished another, other, like, uh, minifigure stuff, and I really want to show those, so, I'll, uh, so, I'll sign off here, and in next episode, uh, we'll start on Hollow Bastion, and then work our way from there. So, for now, thank you guys so much for watching this video, if you liked it, hit that like button, comment below what you think, share this to your friends, and subscribe for more content, and, here's a hell of the road. Thank you guys, and I'll see you next time with Ice Moon Races! <laughs>